Oh, welcome, Waffle Warfets. We are back with Marvel Spider Man The City That Never Sleeps DLC on the PlayStation 4 Pro. And right now, we have started part number three of the DLC Silver Lining. Now, if you didn't see the last video, we defeated Hammerhead. Yuri turned up, she shot Hammerhead in the head and pretty much killed him. So, because of that, she's now been pretty much sent on administrative administrative leave I said that word completely wrong I do apologize but yeah she's being kicked out of the police force while she calms down and all that Hammerhead was uh, brought back to life by one of his goons so Hammerhead is now on the on the uh, prowl again but we don't know where he is at the moment he's probably laying low um, it says in the description of this DLC that Silver Sable is going to come back probably to pick up her gear we also found out in the last episode that uh, Project Olympus is uh, pretty much a combination between Sable and Oscorp's technology and it pretty much turns people into super soldiers and that is now what Hammerhead is wearing so it's pretty much an indestructible super soldier at the moment but yeah we know Silver Sable is going to be coming back to pick up all her gear and apparently there's some sort of civil war going on in Sable's homeland so yeah there's lots of things going on at the moment but yeah I don't know what we're doing here I can't remember but I'm also wearing the Bombastic Bagman suit, if I said that correctly, which is a Fantastic Four themed Spider-Man costume. So yeah, I'm going to wear this probably for this video, and then in the next video, I think I might switch to the other Fantastic Four one. So yeah, let's uh, let's start this mission. Lovely. It is a funny costume, isn't it? <laughs> Off. I love those. It's my turn. Okay, so the, uh, I've mentioned it several times in this uh, expansion, but this is the probably the most important level for you to have like fully upgraded web, like electric webs, because there is all of the enemies in this uh, in this set of DLC are going to have sable tech on them you know so they're all going to be very very strong and very like robotic so having the uh having the web the electric web upgrade upgraded fully is going to be very very useful but this is this is by far probably the hardest stuff in the entire game including the story mode just because all of the enemies are wearing the sable tech you know and uh if you, there's just a bigger variety of enemies it's just a real, it seems like the story mode was everybody's introduction to the game you know so it was a bit nice to you because they know everybody that's playing this DLC has probably finished the story mode. They decided to ramp up the difficulty, <laughs> which I'm a fan of, you know. I didn't like how easy uh, the main story was, and I played it on the top difficulty at the time, you know. Obviously, you've got ultimate difficulty now, nah, but yeah. Can I throw this guy? Oh, I can, lovely. Um, also, I found a way of lowering the uh, fan levels in, uh, in Sony Vegas. So uh, when you watch these videos like the last one is when I started doing it I think for the last like four videos I've been doing it so if you haven't been able to hear the PS4 fan in the video that's good that means I've done a good job <laughs> but yeah it was uh it was not very good it was very very annoying it was really distracting me from my videos but pretty much I have to put my video because my external my uh, microphone is connected to my camera I have to pretty much put my video my like face video into Sony Vegas clip away the video camera footage and keep the audio then save it as an mp3 file then pull it into audacity then get rid of the fan noise then attach it back to the video in sony vega so it's a lot longer than it used to be because i used to do this anyway but it was a lot quicker with my uh, snowball microphone but now i can still do it but it's a very slow process because i have to wait forever for it to bloody save the uh, audio file and all that and it's like an hour 30, you know, so it takes a while. So it's a bit annoying, but it's, it makes my videos better quality, so it's worth it. I was waiting for him to stop looking at me. That's why I was standing there, but yeah, apparently I'm not allowed to do that. <laughs> Have I got any, any webs? Beat him up, beat him up, beat him up. That's it, we've done it. Come 
Come on, Spider-Man! Let's play Save the Pigs. Well, that's just rude. Jetpack guy does not have good intentions. Fantastic. <laughs> oh, hello, ambush guys. Where's your Oh my god. Oh, this is very annoying actually. These uh these new sable tech jetpack guys, they leave those things all around the uh, sky, those like that that like red circle thing. So as you're swinging, if you accidentally swing into one of them, it's going to turn off all your gadgets including your web. So it's it's not too bad, but it's a very big inconvenience. I think I actually remember what I've got to do in this bit and it's actually very annoying. I actually failed at this quite a lot. So um <laughs> I'm not looking forward to doing this bit again. Yeah, if I fail a lot of this next bit I'm going to be doing once we've defeated all these guys. I apologise in advance because when I was doing it on my own I kept screwing up big time. Oh, nice. I need to remember to dodge a bit more. Stick in the same. There you go. It's very easy to deal with the brutes that don't have Gatling guns because you can pick them up and throw them. The ones with Gatling guns, it don't let you pick them up for some reason. Hell yeah, I'm doing pretty alright at the moment. Is he dead? Not Narius. Whew, sorry if you can hear my intense button mashing. <laughs> Definitely the kind of game where you're going to be doing a lot of button mashing. Lovely. Regular dare or a double dog dare? Is that yours? No. But it would be so awesome if it was. You okay? Yeah. Yeah. Long time no see. Who do you work for? <laughs> he works for Hammerhead. Where is this Hammerhead? Whoa, whoa. Can't we, like, go grab a coffee and catch up like normal people? By the way, I love your new hovercrafty thing. Tell me everything you know. Yeah, I talk a lot better without a gun in my face. You have three seconds. Just put the guns down. One. We really gonna do this? Two, six, nine, eleven, eight, seven, three. <laughs> Okay, okay, I'm gonna tell you right now, Sable is probably the strongest motherfucker you'll ever fight in this game. I don't know why, but I have a lot of trouble defeating her. I don't know, can I just chuck stuff on her? It just seems like no matter what I do, I can't really do damage. It feels like, yeah, it feels like you just wanna pretty much throw something at her if you've got anything available. Triangle to get near her, two kicks and then run. That's what it seems like you need to do. You know, if you do anything else, you just take big damage. <laughs> I've got quite a lot of focus though, so I have got quite a lot of health at my disposal, you know, so I can get a bit cocky, I guess. Oh, what the hell? What's she, why does she know how to do these random blocks and do big damage to me? I don't do any damage to her when I dodge her attacks. I suppose I've got my spider, bro. You will stay out of my way or suffer Sorry that they're talking a lot and I'm talking over them, but it's hard for me to shut up when I'm doing a battle, you know. I feel like I need to talk about something. <laughs> I need to mention something, like, you know, have a little chat with you. I don't want to just battle and sit here silently tapping buttons, because that just feels lazy to me. I've got a very, very big problem with seeming lazy, so sometimes I do talk when I shouldn't, you know. So I do apologise for that, it's just me trying my best to put effort into the video, you know, for you guys and girls. So, if it annoys you, I do apologise, but it is just because I care about you guys and girls and I want to actually put effort into my video. I do know I've talked when I shouldn't sometimes. I try not to, you know. Like, I don't talk in cutscenes and things like that. I'm doing a lot better at the moment than I did in my proper playthrough on my own. I did horribly in that. Like, really bad. I died about 25 times. I ain't even planned. <laughs> I don't know what was the matter with me. I think I was just underestimating how strong she was. Ah. Stop putting your shield on, you pussy. How about this? 
God, she's immune. How is she immune to electricity? She's a human being. She doesn't stay worked up for very long, does she? Oh, how'd you like that, Sable? You were kicked in the face, love. Ha! <laughs> did you like that, do ya? Oh, you see that? Our webs are, our web and our bu my web and her bullets were just sort of like bumping into each other, like some sort of Star Wars battle. She's a beast, isn't she? She's worse than every boss in the game. Can I push her? How'd you like that? No, that didn't work. Obviously, I am missing a few of my gadgets, so you have to remember that. And also, I'm missing a lot of upgrades. She's so quick! She knows all my moves! I thought we teamed up in story mode and we made friends of each other. And I thought she also got sad when I was, like, nearly dead. When she discovered me after doing the battle with, uh... I think it was Octavia stabbed me, didn't he? So why is she such a bitch again? Come on! Jesus, how long does this go on for? I don't think I'm doing enough damage to her. Oh, she's so annoying. <laughs> oh, that was bad. That was bad. You see? Oh. Damn you. What happened to you? I thought you were a good guy. I am good at what I do. But I am not a guy. Lost in translation, I guess? <sighs> what happened that you can thank me by not dying? Guess who's back in town? Silver Sable, I know. How did you know that? It's my job to know things. So I imagine she's here to stop Hammerhead from stealing all her shipments. Which is good. Maybe you guys can team up. Yeah, that doesn't feel very likely at this point. Well, listen, I'm gonna keep looking into the Simcaria story. It's... <laughs> that conversation was going nowhere! <laughs> Screwball? How did you... Quick! Head to Aethan Perlman before me and my fans die of boredom! Oh, what is she up to this time? Better get there before she hurts someone. Ugh. Oh god, I really hate Screwball. But yeah, I did mention this in, uh, I think, part two of the DLC. Um, if you do all of the challenges in part three of the DLC, which is this part, Silver Lining, if you do all of the challenges and you get at least bronze in it, you know, you uh, unlock a side mission that will allow you to actually go and take on Screwball and get her arrested. So uh, if you don't like Screwball, that will be a very fun mission. You also need to do it if you're aiming to get all of the trophies. But yeah, when uh, during that cutscene when Spider-Man said, what happened to you can thank me by not dying? That's what uh, Silver Sable said to Spider-Man after he got really badly hurt, you know? Because uh, Peter Parker goes through some absolute hell in uh, the story mode. I mean, obviously, you guys and girls probably already know. I wonder if anybody has bought... I wonder if anybody bought... Um, I don't, can, can you do the DLC without finishing the story? I'm not sure if you can. But I wonder if any, if you can. I wonder if anybody has bought this game and then played the DLC before they've played the main story. That'd be very weird. There'd be a few spoilers, so I don't think they'd actually let you. Maybe it's probably going to come out of a warning. If you play this, there will be story spoilers or something. I don't know. Okay, let's go and deal with this crap. I'm not going to do the challenges, obviously. I'm just letting you guys and girls know what you can do. But I'm definitely not going to do them. Because I absolutely hate these challenges. They're so irritating, you know. And I've already done them on my own account, dub um. <laughs> I don't want to do them on the Beowulf the Wolf account. Well, if it isn't my favourite bug-themed superhero, ready for Season 3? Not really. Aw, turn that frown upside down. We're bringing joy to millions of fans. In fact, I've got big plans this season. If we hit 50 million followers, I'll throw an exclusive party for my loyal fans. Huge party, huh? Sounds like the perfect opportunity to shut her down once and for all. Better keep playing along until that party. Yeah, that's like what I said. So you go and do all of these challenges, get at least bronze in them, and then you'll unlock uh, the side mission 
that will allow you to go to the 50 million follower pie and then you'll find Screwball there and then you can do this annoying like chase thing where you uh, can eventually capture her and arrest her. It's sort of like when we chase Black Cat in the first part of this DLC. So it's sort of similar to that, I guess. Lovely. But yeah, we're going to be doing the main story. Screwball is at the party IRL. Oh no! She's rubbing off on me. <laughs> I have to get her behind bars before I turn into someone I hate. Lovely. There's nothing wrong with saying IRL. I think people say that quite a lot, actually. I think that's a common one, sort of like LOL, you know. Some of them are annoying, but some of them, you know, are just common language nowadays. It's funny when old people think LOL means lots of love. I've seen it happen so many times on Facebook, you know. <laughs> and it can cause some very, very bad situations. I'm just waiting to be contacted by Mary Jane again. I'm going to talk until she talk, uh, until she contacts me. But yeah, uh, sometimes there'll be like, I don't know, somebody will make a post. Hey MJ, sorry we got cut short earlier. Had to deal with Screwball again. You seem to have a lot of women in your life lately. And all of them challenging. Except for you, of course. Huh. You don't think I'm challenging? Um, no. Unless you want me to think you're challenging. In which case, you, uh, challenge me in all the right ways. <laughs> well done. Thank you. Okay, I'll keep looking into Hammerhead's plans, and I'll call you when I find something... challenging. In the meantime, I'll swing around the city and do some spidey stuff. Ah! Perfect! I guarantee you, though, I guarantee you, whilst I'm trying to have a chat with you guys and girls, I guarantee you Miles is going to appear out of nowhere and start trying to talk to me, because he does it every bloody time. Ah, okay, right, we've got to do one of these things. Better check it out. Like I said, this happens in every single bit of DLC. Part 1, 2 and 3, you have a random story mission that will once again open up all of the uh, crimes. Or will open up all of the base tokens that you need to do. Or um, also unlock the screwball challenges. You get this in every single DLC. I think part 1 unlocks the crimes and introduces you to the crimes again and the screwball challenges. Part 2 uh, it uh, introduces you to the screwball challenges again and then it also opens up all of those random base places where you have to those base places where you have to do like six waves of enemies and you get the base tokens it unlocks them and then in part 3 you also get another mission that unlocks the screwball challenges again and once again I think this opens up the base places again but yeah uh, you should do all of the content in this side in this uh, DLC because even the side stuff provides a bit of story like doing all of the base token stuff and all of the uh, challenges and that, you do get additional story. Like I think the collectible in this uh, set of DLC, I don't know if it's in part 2 or part 3, but it gives you a lot of information about Yuri and why she's got such a vendetta against like Hammerhead and the Magia and that. So it is nice to do the additional stuff, you know, but I'm just sticking with the main story. If you guys and girls enjoy it, you know, you can buy the game and you can enjoy the side content too. Uh, just checking in. You busy? Sort of. How are your assignments coming? You mean school assignments or spider assignments? Both, but school comes first. I'm all caught up on school stuff, working on spider assignments now. But why are you making me do physics and calculus equations? Shouldn't I be practicing with web shooters and gadgets and stuff? Okay, quiz time. If a pendulum is 40 meters long and attached at a 45 degree angle, how far will the pendulum fall at its lowest point? 11.72 meters. But why does that matter? It matters a lot if you're the pendulum. What? Oh! Wait, so you do all these equations in your head like while you're swinging through the city? I have to. And so will you if you want to get good at it. Wow. I had no idea. All right. Guess I'll get back to it then. Man, you must be so damn quick at maths if you can randomly do calculations in your head and randomly know the height of a building before you've jumped off of it so you can work out whether jumping off and swinging will equal you swinging straight into the floor. You must be a, you must be a genius, Peter Parker. I mean, doing the maths, you know, that's one thing, but knowing the exact height of where you're standing, that's just genius, that is. That's like you can tell the future. But how would you know the height of each of these buildings? How would you know that you're currently 100 meters in the sky so you can do this and this with this swing? <laughs> okay then, lovely. Right, let's get down here now and help us do that. Huh. 
Open up. Or we'll open it for you! Leave me alone! Gotta get to that driver before they do. Take this easy on yourself and let us... Okay, this is very similar to what I was doing with the Magia family. You just gotta stop them from breaking into these trucks. Because if I remember correctly, these Ob these Oscorp industry trucks are filled with like uh, the Olympus, Project Olympus stuff that Silver Sable and Oscorp have been developing together. So you gotta stop them from breaking into the door and driving off. I mean, even if they break the door down and they get to do that, they're still not gonna be able to do anything, you know, because they're not gonna be able to drive away when I'm standing right here. <laughs> Oh uh, dear, I think there's a flying dude then. What was there? Oh, it might have just been my drone. I'm not too sure. Oh, lovely. Lovely. I flipping love the... Uh, oh shit, oh shit. Quick, 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 quick. I don't know how much time I've got. Come on. There we go, lovely. These dudes with the lightsabers are proper cool, aren't they? I wish I had one of them. Man, that'd be well cool. Just running around with one of them. That'd be badass. I don't know what I'd need it for, but it'd just be nice to have one, you know? <laughs> sort of like the people that keep samurai swords in their front room, you know? You don't need them, you're never gonna chop someone in half, so, you know, why have you got them? It's just because they're cool, that's why. Okay, let's, uh... Watch out. It's good to use your combo on these flying guys, your uh, finishers, I mean, not your combos. Lovely. It's so good to have two for the price of one upgrade. It's brilliant. It's not called that, it's just why I call it. I mean, how can I even get through the door? Have you seen the amount of people I've webbed to that door? Nobody's going to get in or out of that place. <laughs> and stick them to the wall. Lovely. Brilliant. I take a bow, but. I'm trying to work on my humility. What's up? Thanks, Spider-Man. That was a close one. That's all right, mate. Ain't gonna thank me. Got it from here, Spidey. This tech isn't going anywhere. Who said that? Hey, MJ, what's up? Hammerhead guys are hitting an Oscorp shipping facility near Seaport. Got it. I'm headed there now. Question for you. We know Hammerhead stole most of the Sable weapons already, and a bunch of equipment from police lockup. Now he's stealing Sable tech that's bound for Simcaria. Where is he putting all this stuff? No idea. But if we can find out where, we can cut off his supplies. I'll try to cross-reference his men's activity with the city map. See if I can't nail down a location. Good plan. Hey, so I've been reading up on the situation in Simkaria. There's a ruling dictator attacking his own people. Apparently Silver Sable's been working alone to arm the rebels and fight back, but she's losing. Sounds like she could really use the stuff Hammerhead is stealing from her. Explains why she's so angry and desperate. Maybe. But I also think that angry is just her default emotion. I'll let you know what I find at the shipping facility. That's probably my default emotion as well. I'm just always angry. I'll, I'll tell you what, well, if you met me in real life, you wouldn't get the same impression of me in real life that you than you do on YouTube. I mean, I'm not nasty or anything like that, you know. I'm just very angry looking, you know. I, I am always angry, you know, and that makes me look unapproachable. But I'll tell you right now, if you ever see me in the street, you know, I'm not the best person to talk to, you know, I'm terrible at talking, but you know, if you see me in the street and you come up and say hi, I guarantee you I'll say hello back, you know, I'll take a picture with you, you know, fist bump you, whatever you want, you know, so yeah, you ain't got to worry about that, you know. I know I say all the time that I'm very angry, but I am very angry, but I'm not, I'm not an arsehole, you know, I'm just very angry for my own reasons, you know, but I'm not angry at you guys, you know, it's very hard to explain, I'm a very, I'm a very dodgy person, <laughs> That sounds terrible, but you know, that's just the only way I can explain it. Oh, dude. I just don't understand how the flipping hell everybody knows I'm Spider-Man. I mean, look at me. I mean, if you didn't see me using my webs, how would you know it's me? I'm dressed up like some sort of twat. Am I supposed to be following these or actually taking them down? Oh, I know what's gonna happen. 
Yeah, I already know what's going to happen. Uh, I didn't really want this to happen now, actually, because this is a very inconvenient timing. This video is probably going to be a bit longer now, I reckon. Hopefully, I can get it done within five minutes, because I don't want to have to do this over multiple videos. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, I nearly fouled at that. Oh, please. Please, no. Oh, God. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if this is the mission I'm thinking of, but I think it is. Oh dear. There's a lot of people, isn't there? Come here, you son of a bitch. I don't get why they need so much Olympus, uh, Project Olympus stuff. They've already got a shit ton of it, you know? Yeah, I wish it was just that easy, Spider Man, but I feel like it's about to get harder thanks to a something going up that's going to happen in a minute if I'm thinking of the right mission. Oh, I don't like it when I'm in a rush. I do not like it. I'm always in a rush when I do these videos. I don't want it to be amplified. She's gonna kill someone. I was going to say that exact same thing. <laughs> she just randomly shooting. Do I need to take down these cars or Silver Sable? I think I need to take down these cars. Yeah. Okay. Oh shit. Careful, careful. Right, I've got four minutes. I've got four minutes. What well, first we can do this? We can do this. It's just when I have to try and like stop Sable, if I remember correctly. Or stop her from shooting. I've got to do something. And it, it takes a while because I think I need to like chase a bunch of things or do a bunch of annoying things and it really slows me down. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That's it. That's it. Lovely job, Lou. This, this costume looks so stupid, doesn't it? <laughs> it's, it's bloody hilarious, but I don't know. It, I don't know. It's, it's good, but stupid. Flipping hell. I thought I had to um, take down the actual main convoy, not just these stupid cars. There is a lot of stuff to chase in there. Why do I have to slow it down? I mean, 90% of the population is probably dead thanks to Devil's Breath. Oh, that's what it was called. A couple of videos back, I couldn't remember what it was called. It was called. De oh, no. That's the stuff I was telling you about at the beginning of this video, wasn't it? Yeah. Where you swing into them and they sort of like interrupt you and you can't use any of your gadgets for a little bit. Is it Silver Sable shooting those? What's she stopping me for? I'm, help I'm helping her take down. I'm helping her take down the cars. Is she stopping me? What's that all about? I thought she wanted to stop her. Oh, come on, Spider Man. Don't start being a cock. Get off the wall. Fuck me. Is it possible for me to lose these cars? I hope not. Are they just doing loops? Oh, fuck. Got two minutes left. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, we can do this. Okay, this is where things get a little bit annoying, if I remember correctly. Because I don't think you actually know if you're hitting them or not. You just gotta get really close and just spam R1 and hope you're hitting them. Oh, there we go. That gave me a little box then. That's nice. How many more are left? Two. Did I only take down one? It's just such an awkward mission. It's so annoying. Okay, that's two. Did the other one just blow up on its own? Oh no, it's still alive. Of course it's still alive. Yeah, this video is going to be a bit longer, so uh, the video after this, there's a good chance that there's going to be some noise at the end of the video, because I have literally one hour 30 exactly to record, you know, if I'm making three videos, each video has to be 30. Sometimes I can get away with an extra five minutes, but not often, you know. What's it more of them for? Oh, come on! 
Oh, we're going to land on a ship. Oh, yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Oh, yeah, we've got to land on a ship and shoot these drones, I think. There we go. Oh, oh, she got some more friends. Where's she getting all these things? No, 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 no. That's it, that's it, come on. want the same thing. If we work together, we'll find him. Trust me. Right. We work together. Like partners. Yeah. Partners. <laughs> So you'll call me? I am 77% sure she's not a robot. Attention units, there's an assault in progress. That doesn't sound good. Better check it out. We better go and check it out next time, you mean? <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to have to end the video now, Wolf Wolf. It only took me two minutes longer than uh, was planned, so not too bad. But yeah, thanks for watching, Wolf Wolf. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Like, share, and join the pack today. Oh!